Hello everyone and welcome back to John's Food Review. Today we're going to be trying Sweet Chaos Original Popcorn Peanut Butter Cup. So I saw these at, um, where was I? I was at Food Lion. Um, and I saw them, I'm like, I haven't tried this one. So we tried the cake batter one, we tried the uh, black and white drizzle, so. Peanut butter cup. Now, apparently, this is the only one that we, uh, only other one I can find. Um, I also did manage to find the uh, caramel only of these, uh, the ones that I, the, the creators ones. Uh, you've seen them. Like they had the cheddar and, and those. I'm like, oh yeah, it'd be great if there was just a bag full of the caramel, uh, the caramel ones. Well, there, there are. Um, but. Same thing as the last time on the back. It may contain milk, peanut, soy. Now, um, get ready for bursts of peanut butter flavor. Well, I don't want to rip it. Rip it good. You'll thank me later. Um, just like the cake batter one. The ones that are stuck together. So it's just uh, chocolate and uh, peanut butter drizzle. Hmm. Definitely tastes peanut butter. Oh, that's good. Hmm. Seems like a hint of coffee. Dark chocolatey, with dark chocolatey and peanut buttery drizzles. But I guess it might be like the mixture of the popcorn and everything. It just, it kind of tastes like coffee, which I don't really like. Really good though. Yep, this stuff. It's a weird cough. But that's, uh, yeah. You got the peanut butter, you got the chocolate drizzle. In the back, it's still the same as the other one. Also popped in coconut oil, which is good for you. Real sugar cane, sea salt. Yeah. Questions or comments? If there's anything different. Nope, nothing's really different about this. I mean, packaging wise, the flavor wise, it's just obviously different. I got poopy on my hand. Hmm. I don't know, I think there's maybe too much saltiness because obviously it's got salt on it because of, you know, sea salt. But peanut butter is also salty. You have the dark chocolate, which I'm glad they went with dark chocolate. That kind of helps get through that saltiness. Stay hydrated, kids. Uh, but it's like salty on salty on chocolatey. But like I said, I'm glad they went with um, dark.
dark chocolate because I, I, I really think that dark chocolate just has more superior taste when it comes to, you know, something that gets you coming back. It's always, for me, sir, I love dark chocolate. Apart from it being good for you, it just, for me, it just has a better taste. Um, whenever I see something that has dark chocolate as opposed to just regular milk chocolate, I get dark chocolate because it just tastes better. Um, if I was to make a milkshake or something, instead of using chocolate, I would use dark chocolate. Because I just, I prefer it. Um, pretty prominent flavors on all of them. You can taste the dark chocolate, you can taste the peanut butter, you can taste the popcorn, which is weird. But um, it does kind of have a bit of a coffee flavor to it, like an aftertaste. Like I said, I think it's just the, you know, caramel macchiato kind of thing. Like a peanut butter, caramel, uh, you know, caramel macchiato kind of thing going on there. It kind of tastes like the, uh, the one you'd get at like McDonald's or something. Even though it's peanut butter, it does have very much of a, you know, caramelly, you know, mocha flavor to it. I think it's just because of the saltiness and the, the way of the, the popcorn. So I think it is just popcorn. It's not kettle corn. No, it says kettle corn, but kettle corn is usually a bit crunchier. This is just tastes like flat out just popcorn. Um, but yeah, I saw it at Ingle, uh, not Ingles, at um, Food Lion. I'm like, I also got other stuff at Food Lion. I don't even remember. What was it? Um, obviously not this time, but just a preview. Got these, these Eggo. Frosted maple syrup, pop tarts, and then these uh, frosted apple fritters. Never had them before. These are yeah, they're new, and actually they're both new. So, um, yeah, so those should be pretty good. The Eggo ones, I'm like, uh, I looked at them like it, it sounds kind of gross. But the apple fritter, I mean, I love apple fritters. So when I used to work at Angles, I either got the um, the corn dog, not the corn dogs, the chili dogs that were there in the in the bakery section, or I got a couple of apple fritters, and that was my lunch. So I love apple fritters. Um, but hopefully those are good. But they probably are just going to taste like anything else, like a cinnamon apple kind of thing. Just you can only do so much before the flavors start tasting the same. But anyways, yeah, the popcorn. It's pretty good. Um, I think the cake batter is probably my favorite one. I mean, I think there's only like three of them, like the dessert flavors that I can find in the store. Um, so it'd probably be the cake batter one, and then the other one, the chocolate, white, dark chocolate drizzle. And then this one. This one's good, but it's just, it's so salty. You know, like I said, peanut butter is salty already. Plus, they've got the sea salt. It's just unnecessary saltiness. But uh, it's still good. Um, maybe drizzle, like if you're at home or something, just like a little more you know, chocolate or something on it to try to even things out. But other than that, it's good. It's good. Good. Anyways. Just checking on Sam. Sleeping. Boop, boop. Um... Yeah. Anyways, that's gonna do it for me. You guys know the drill. I'll see you guys later. Bye, guys.